Jane, who's in studio with us? Come on, Jane, tell I'm t- me. I'm talking to them off the air. I'm okay. so sorry. I'm super excited about our guests today. We've got uh, Sonia Horvath from the Chicago Parks Foundation. She's the director of special events. So we have a special event to talk about. And also we have Kyle from Baby Cakes. It's a food truck that makes amazing pancakes. And by the way, Steve, I don't know if you've seen the stack that we have here in the studio, but I'm going to eat them. The biggest PR firm in the world and made the- sure this <laughs> happened today. <laughs> <laughs> she said, everyone's fired, including me, if I don't bring pancakes. And I've never been angry with her in my life, ever, oh. ever. Imagine if I did get mad, how much stuff we'd get. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> i got to start working on my acting. Uh, but anyway, I'm glad you guys are here. Thanks for uh, getting up, even though in a pancake biz, you're up anyway, right, yeah, Kyle? Breakfast. Uh, yeah, yeah, certainly. Baker's hours. <laughs> yeah, uh, which means you get up at what time? Uh, I wake up uh, right around 11 p.m. Oh, you're totally third shift then, huh? Entirely, yeah. Wow, I didn't even think about that. So 11 p.m., and then you start uh, uh, mixing batter and stuff. What time? Yeah, right around midnight. Wow. Wow. So this is like dinner for you right now, this time of day. Yeah, basically. It's my happy day. hour, I'd End say. Of day. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you guys have any cocktails or anything, that'd be nice. We'll have some juice. Um, Fair enough. <laughs> we have the greatest park system in the world in Chicago. And of course, supporting it's a big deal. And if you go to chicagoparksfoundation.org, you can. Find out all about how the marathon's being supported. But there's a there's a step up event, if you will, coming up this weekend. So, uh, Sonia, why don't you fill us in? Yeah, thanks so much. We're doing our inaugural Run for the Parks 5K Run Walker Roll this Sunday at uh, just south of 31st Street Beach. We're really excited. It's going to be a great day for racing, a great day for a walk, a great day for a roll. It's going to be perfect weather, and um, we're feeling really good about it. And the post-race party with a pancake never hurt anybody. (laughs) No, it never hurt anybody, especially not pancakes after a race. So it's important to note, run, walk, roll. True. So roll could be on a bike or a rolling, like a, tr- a stroller, any kind of roll. So it's it's an accessible run. So oh, we're good. we're open to anybody that's in a wheelchair or other abilities. So that's what makes, to, uh, to us, to this race so important, not only to celebrate our 10th year, but to make this race not just a north side run, not another run that isn't open to all. We want this to be an inclusive event, and we're really excited to be able to open it to people with all abilities. That's what the role is all about. And, and, I, and I know everybody can come and all that, but how do they how do they financially support it? Is there a registration fee? Do you donate just to be kind? What do you do? Yeah, we have a registration fee. It's on our website, chicagoparksfoundation.org slash run. You can register anytime leading up to the race, even walking up on event day. You can show up and get ready to walk, run, or roll with us. So between now and Sunday, join us. Well, and it's important to note, it is on a paved parkway Truth. along the lakefront. Yeah, it's on the lakefront path. It's an out-and-back timed 5K race, and um, whether you're walking, running, or rolling, we'll be getting a timed chip and bib on you, and then a beer and a pancake in your belly after the fact. So the obvious question, <laughs> Kyle, is give up all your secrets. What's the secret to a great pancake? Uh, the secret to a great pancake, uh, first thing is you have to let the batter rise can't just mix the batter and then just throw it right on the griddle. That's you got to let it rise, little little air get going in there. Let the yeast mm. go, you know, get that working. And then um, do you fan it? Do you stand over it with a giant uh, bamboo? No, just broth? give it some space. You know, I'll go give on, it a little room. Yeah, go on about <laughs> so your day. So your batter's going. Hey, I need coffee. a little space. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> give it give it a half hour and then go back to it. Even make it the night before and put it in the refrigerator. That can oh. work too. Um, oh, listen, another, that's, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> another tip is uh, you can substitute your liquid with some kind of uh, bubbly fluid. Like yeah. for instance, you could put like a seltzer, seven up, um, a seven up, or even maybe um, champagne. Or something like that. <gasps> yeah. Uh, so that Kyle, also Kyle, works. Kyle, is there something you want to tell us? Uh, uh, no, I'm, I'm having a great time today. <laughs> okay. All right. Fine. Okay. Um, and uh, what is the biggest mistake people make outside of not letting their batter rise? Too quick? They pull them too quick? It's dialing in the temperature on the griddle. You really, you have to know your equipment. Every griddle's a little I, bit different. If I had a nickel for every time I told you that, Jane, you have to know your equipment. <laughs> <laughs> so you got to kind of throw the first test one on, see how it goes. Really figure out if it needs to be, you know, hotter or colder, where you're at with the temperature. So. Well, I think it's super cool about baby cakes. Not only will we be at the race, the run, walk, roll on Sunday uh, with Chicago Park Foundation, 
but you guys are a food truck and you do a ton of catering. And I've seen you, I've been to weddings where your truck is there and you're doing, it's not just like, oh, like dad's pancake in the morning on Sunday morning. <laughs> you have elevated gourmet pancakes. So there's different flavors. So what we call it is we call it breakfast fusion. So it's not just pancakes. I mean, it started with pancakes. That was the original idea from Leah, our owner and, and head chef. Um, she uh, basically had this idea that you could kind of turn anything into a pancake. So within the first year or so, she had something like over 300 flavors of pancakes that she had created, all you know, creating different global cuisines, different ideas, strawberry, margarita, pancakes, um, you know, uh, Korean steak, uh, flat you know, pancakes with, with scallions, all different kinds of pancakes. Um, gosh, I mean, cookies and cream, cookies and screams for Halloween, mm-hmm. that type of thing. <laughs> so. and, and what is the name of the food truck? The name of the food truck is Sweetheart. Sweetheart. And she was born in 1974. Mm. Uh, she's getting close to uh, quite an important birthday. Yeah. Well, that's wow. Really cool. very, very much so. I, I saw a, a list of funny food truck names that were great the other day. Um, and, uh, one of my favorites was hit and run, Oh my gosh. you know, which is a truck that you get a sandwich quickly and move right. on. You're going to stop when you see something that says hit and run. <laughs> uh, but there's great names out there for food trucks and the food truck business is here and there and stuff, but you guys are getting it done. Uh, yeah, we're working on it. All right. So plug baby cakes as well. Since you guys are kind enough to be involved. Uh, baby cakes is a breakfast catering company here in Chicago. We serve the entire Chicago area. Um, we're available 24 hours a day, whatever you need. Um, basically, we have a website, uh, babycakespancakes.com. You can look us up, Google us, Pancakes Chicago, Food Truck Pancakes. We're the first ones. So. There you go. Yeah. And, and by the way, bubblegum pancakes, apple bacon bourbon pancakes, pineapple upside down pancakes. Oh, I love those ones. Wait, and isn't there a unicorn magic pancake? Indeed, there is unicorn magic in our pancakes. Unicorns are real. And magic. Yeah. And in our pancakes. And a perfect pancake flavor. And right? perfect. <laughs> ingredient. Perfect for the 5K run, walk, or roll on So morning. here's what we need you to do, Sonia. We need you to tell us exactly again how to get involved and make sure we're there this weekend. Thanks. Yeah. So Let's say I had this friend named Beth who didn't know she was going to go. <laughs> um, and, uh, and she wanted information. Yeah. Beth, I'd say to her to head to our website, chicagoparksfoundation.org, to learn about the Run for the Parks 5K Run, Walk, and Roll by the Chicago Parks Foundation. This Sunday, September. 10th, just south of 31st Street Beach on the Lakefront Path. This out and back timed 5K. We'd welcome you to join it with your family, your friends, and join us for a post race party with beer, pancakes, coffee, a beer mosa, even. Um, and we look forward to seeing you there, Beth and all. Pretty good. <laughs> really Pretty good. good. Pretty good. I'm, I'm in. Again, donate on the website if you can't make it as well. And you do that at what website? One more time. ChicagoParksFoundation.org. Yeah. And, and the, we got to remember the Chicago Parks Foundation does a lot of good things throughout the entire year to keep our Chicago parks beautiful. Truly. Yep. There's 600 parks in the city and there's a lot of work to be done. We have a lot of different ways to get involved, whether it's the 5K or our volunteering or our marathon team or our golf outing. The list goes on and on. And I can't wait to see you guys this weekend and beyond well thank you for doing it thank you beth thank you uh kyle as well Thanks and um, if you're looking for a name for your food truck uh doggy style is taken uh, it's a hot dog uh, truck uh cluck it up <laughs> cluck it up is jake is uh. taken it's a chicken truck obviously r.i.p to the chubby wiener <laughs> i thought that was a special a doggy style <laughs> Ask me about my winner. (laughs) Oh, boy. We've got problems. Uh, Please help your Chicago park stay beautiful and uh, get out there and contribute or contribute online if you can't make it. And uh, good luck with the marathon push as well. All right, you guys. Thank you.